Hello Lilas, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> As you guys see, I have two babies here. And um, one is done done. I mean, I did notice a few shine spots on her, but I'm not going back to be bothered with it. <laughs> it's She's my personal baby. And I mean, that happens. I mean, you know. So, but this one is not done. Um, she still needs her lips glossed. She notes she still needs, um, you know, just little stuff that has to be done towards the end. Her nails, gloss, all that stuff. Um, and then a good washing. Um, <laughs> but I did want to show her. I don't know which one you guys would want to see first. We can start with the itty bitty first, I guess. But guys, before I get started, please make sure that you hit that subscribe button. Go ahead and do that now. I'll wait. Mm -hmm. Okay, honey, it shouldn't have took you that long. Just hit the subscribe button. Thank you. I appreciate you. And if you would click the bell to be a part of the notification squad, yes. And please join the chatter box to become a chatter king, a chatter queen, um, a queen Lola's. <laughs> so um, it, the link is in the description bar as well. Make sure you're following me on Instagram. Make sure you're also following me on my blog if you like to read. It is MissSerenitySmithBabies.com. And yes, okay. So, the first little one, you guys remember, I got her about a week ago. And don't judge me. But she is little... <laughs> She's a little birding by um, Elsie Rodriguez. And painted, by, painted and rooted by myself. Don't worry, she got wild hair. She just woke up. <laughs> oh, I didn't bring her. Gosh, I didn't bring her magnet, magnetic stump. So I gave her a magnetic, um, interchangeable belly button. Um, she has both the regular butt belly button that goes there um, is magnetic, and then she also has the actual umbilical stump that goes there. Um, but I like her without either one of them, to be honest. I don't, I don't, I really do. So, she's loving her baby cousin. And I found this little shirt. Um, it was one that I had ordered a while back, but it was too small for the baby that I had ordered it for. And I just held on to it because I was like, one day, maybe, you know. And sure enough, so, yeah, so if you look at her, she's, She's really a petite little girl, um, very detailed. Um, she has veining. Um, you can see some of the veining in, in her her legs and her arms and stuff, and you know her chest, everything. Um, so yeah, she's 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 kind of she's she's detailed. She's got veins, you know, front back. Um, she's modeled all the way o over because she's preemie. So I kind of wanted her to be very preemie light. Um, she has an open mouth and she has a tongue in there. And um, so yeah. So and I opened her mouth a little bit wider so that she can take a pacifier really good. Um, her hair, I rooted it. It's full. So it's full. But it's sparsely because I think preemies. It, 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 even though it looked thick, it shouldn't be like, well, I ain't gonna say it shouldn't be because um, black babies can be born with a head full of hair even if they're like two weeks gestation. I don't know. Sometime. Um, sometime, not sometime. But I did give her a full head of hair and it's not pluggy or anything, but I did rule her in like two Two days <laughs> that was a record um but it was non-stop me falling asleep with a needle in my hand type thing and she has cute little eyelashes i really took my time and and gave her some really um uh, wispy eyelashes but she is her head is probably about the size of an apple so it's very very small um now to the big baby i don't know baby i might need to move you because you might get smashy here you go. All right. Well, I don't know if you guys can see. Oh, I lay her next to the bottle. Let me show you how small she is. 
I lay her next to the baby bottle and I was like laughing. Look at the baby bottle. Here. That's, she's, she's tiny. Like this is a, a baby bottle and she's like almost that size. Uh, all right. So this is baby Jolie. <laughs> Little mama that gave me a bit of a fuss to get some color. She finally got color. <laughs> so she is um, Jolie by Sylvia Manning. And of course painted by me. Like I said, she still got some shine spots. But I love her feet. I think the coloring on her feet came out really nice. Um, don't know how that happened, but it happened. And um, <laughs> she's a very soft baby. Um, this baby... Like her, her nails are tipped. I don't know if you guys can see that, but her nails are tipped. She has lots of, I won't say lots of lots, but she does have quite a bit of veining. Um, she does have mottling all over. So, and she has that light baby, you know, the hand effect where they, the hands are lighter. So, and I think I love her. I love the coloring on her fist, the way that it turned out. Um, like I said, she hasn't been glossed or anything. This is her head. And she, again, has veining and details in her face. Let me see what you guys can see. Because it is so hard for me sometimes to see what I'm actually showing you guys. Um, Alright. So, I'll get a little closer. Like I said, just understand that she still have some touch-ups still need a good bath so she might have a little bit of matting powder residue on her and um she does have shine spots left and she has her lips and stuff hasn't been glossed so she is not complete but i just wanted to show her because a couple of people was asking me about her size and all that jazz and i'm just like well let me see. Now I can't uh, accidentally turn the camera. Yep. All right. There we go. All right. So, like I said, big baby. Um, she has elbow armatures. Her neck wrinkles so much. Like she has these little. Oh, I wish you guys can see, but she has like just so many wrinkles in her neck. I don't know if you can like. I don't know if you guys can see that, but, and you know, her ears are, are detailed. I like detailed everything on her. <laughs> um, so, and she is going to go home with this t-shirt. Say that is mine. Say it is my, my, mine. So this is her tummy. And her little belly button so like I said she's a big girl see I'm a big girl I'm a big girl yes I am she is gonna look so good when she's fully completed though um she has a cute as little bum bum so and she is soft like I said she is very soft and so she's as you can see she's flexible she's a big girl you do have to really support her head, especially because it's a she has a bigger head and you know she's just super soft. So you definitely want to I don't just let her head fall back. And I won't even do it for you guys, and especially this is not my baby. But um you see she has chunky thighs. Chunk chunk chunk. And she has um she has some little, she has a little things that her mommy, her mommy likes certain things and I wanted to get her as nice as possible. I love the inside of her mouth. I wish I could show you guys her tongue, well her tongue, like her tongue is so, is so perfect. I don't know. Let me see. Ah, <sighs> this is so hard. If I ever get a chance to get it, capture it on camera, on picture, 
I will try. See, you can see the inside of her foot. It's a shine spot right there, big shine spot. Um, but don't worry, that will be gone. Let me see if I can go in. All right, let's see. Let's see. So you can see her hands, the different, the, the, the um, lightness of her hands. Now, I got her this close so I could see if you guys can see inside her mouth. In just a second, let me see. All right, let's see. All right, you know what? Come out. Oh, I forgot I took your diaper off. All right, let's see. Can you guys see in there? Wait. <laughs> Good dog. I don't know if you guys can see. I don't know. When I do the playback, I'll see if you guys can see. Um, but, all right, so let's flip her over. Come here. Come on, boo -boo. Wait, wait. Let's, let's turn, zoom this back out so you guys can see. All right. All right, so let's turn her over. Oh, there you go. Which way you want to lay? You want to lay that way? Okay. Look at this. She literally just slobbed on me. Well, I'm glad I turned you over, Mommy, because you have water in your mouth or something. Or you're a real girl. She, I think she's a real girl. Look, she literally just slobbed on me. Oh my gosh, she is real. I knew she was real. Oh my goodness, look at this. Look at these hands. I love her hands. I love it. I love her. I love this baby. I don't want to let her go. I don't want to let her go. Anyway, like I said, she still has a little bit of residue and I like, see that's a shine spot. I'll get that. But and then like the, the the bottom of her foot right here, this one is a, it's got a little shine spot right there. It's just so hard. All right, and so she wrinkles really nice. She has the cutest little bum bum, I'm telling you guys. I wanted to show you guys her back. So I try not to leave no, nothing undone. So she does have mottling on her, on her back as well. And some, a little bit of vein in. That's her little bum bum. She's a cute little tushy. <laughs> see, I got a cute little tushy in some of my backpack. Let me see what you guys, if you guys can see. Oh my goodness. I can't believe she drooled on me. But yeah. So yeah, you can see. <laughs> she is. Okay. All right, so let me, um, and someone asked me, does her head turn easily? Absolutely. She has the best, her head turns very nicely. Um, it's just, I just laid her down and I didn't really do it. So, and sometimes she likes to gnaw on this fist. So she, she does that sometimes. Say, cause I'm a booger. I'm a auntie's booger baby. Yeah, so she has, she has nice ears. So she's a good baby and she's a good size too. She has really nice feet, size feet. She's gonna fit shoes really nice. Um, I had her on socks, but I took them off. Girl, she just slopped on me again. Okay, wait, wait, I'm sorry guys. I just, I, think, I thought she was spitting up. Okay, yeah, see that? She literally had, you got anything, any more water in your, your mouth? Because little drooly boo, wetting auntie up. Okay. So yeah, this is, this is her. This is, say so now I'm all disheveled, but that's okay because auntie going to work on me today. So she's going to go and get the rest of everything done today so she can I haven't even got her nothing to wear home but I didn't expect to finish her so 
quickly, but I have babies born this weekend. Babies, babies, babies. So, so yeah, so that's, that's her. And like I said, her head does turn very easy. And it, her neck and all that wrinkles when it does. So that's her. That's my little sugar bump. And so, um, like I said, her, her fists are very detailed. Again, beautiful vein, and if I say so myself, I don't know if I'm allowed to say that. Um, don't want to sound arrogant, but I do think the veining is pretty. And I love the tip. I love her fingernails. Her fingernails are really nice. And the tipping is really nice in her fingers. I don't know if you guys can, can see. Uh, so yeah so she's I had to pray over this little one <laughs> but but she she came she came came out good I'm sure you what she looks like with her little socks on her feet if you guys are following me on Instagram you guys probably already seen these photos with her I think she looks good in this pink really makes her color pop and shows that she has color she is um a very nice light skinned baby. She could, you could say she was a uh, biracial if you wanted to, but I think she's definitely AA. She has, um, she has nice, nice skin color. She's, um, and I don't know why, but I didn't realize, I think it's because, remember I told you guys as I learned stuff on her, I did it on this one but I I didn't realize that their color blend quite a bit is that funny or what although their color blends it took me longer to get her there than this one look look at that they, they do kind of blend but she's a little bit more red and I think I did that because she's preemie so she she does have a little bit more red in her but they are they are similar in color. I didn't realize that. Look at y'all. <laughs> so they do have some of the same coloring, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, they have similar details. That is cool. This one, let me show you her little bum bum. Her little bum bum is so cute. I enjoy painting her I was gonna do a twin to her and I'm a little indecisive on it right now because I'm debating should I just let her just go with a bigger size than like a next size up so that I don't have the same scope I don't think I want the same scope twice when I really think about it so this is her look at her little bum bum it's so cute so both but Jolie definitely have more bum bum than her. But they they are very cute babies. Very unique in their own way. Um, I don't know the inches and, you know, the measurements of... Um, I don't know the measurements of uh, Jolie. Because, like I said, the kid was just... She was sent to me. The kid. I want to say the kid, not the kid. The kid was just sent to me. Like, and she's very detailed, like, in, inside, like, her, her thighs and stuff, everything is very, very detailed on her. Um, but, so I didn't really get the measurements on her, but she's, she's a fat baby. Like, she's good and chunky. Um, I want to say she, I don't know, her, I, I haven't put her on a scale but I would think that she was heavier than um, Phoebe, but maybe not. So yeah, so there you have it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, let me know what you guys think. Do you like her size? Um, I know that the, the, the scope has an awake version of this baby. It's not supposed to be the same scope, but to me, the body style and everything, it's very similar, so. Um, did I show, 
your wrinkles. Oh gosh. Oh. Let's see. And forgive me for the light. It's a little. Oh. So she. Look at her. Look at her aunties. So she's. Her coloring, sometimes it comes across a little more orangey on camera than what it really is. Um, she's not an orangey baby. And I know, and I absolutely do not like the orangey color. So she's definitely not an orangey baby in person. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping that her mom find her more beautiful in person than on camera but we will see that is all to be determined and her mom is very vocal <laughs> so I'm sure she will let me know <laughs> so um let me oh gosh let me see what you guys see it's just like I just can't I hate that there see you guys I can't see you guys can't see all right, so although they're in the same skin tone, and this is one of the things of just, just you know, I always gotta preach and teach, not really. I, I just like to explain stuff. Although they are um, very um, similar in color, the way the coloring is, is very different. If you look at her light off from the side, they don't look the same color. And it's because I painted one to be I try to paint them according to their age size. So she's very preemie. I, I wanted her to be very preemie like. And so her, everything about her, even like definitely like her feet and stuff and hands are pre more preemie than, you know, a baby that's, you know, six, eight weeks old. Because I would definitely say that that little Miss Jolie is about six, eight weeks old. So that's what, you know, that's the part that I try so hard to get right. So anyway, I know this is a long video. I, for all the Jolie fans out there, um, I just wanted to give you guys a video of her. Um, I will, before she go, do another video of her. Um, a lot of requests on her, a lot of interest in her. But she is, she does have a mommy. She was a custom. Um, and so, yeah, because, and she has, <laughs> she has her little beauty mark. I didn't show that, but um, so different things were done specific to the mommy's taste. Um, not dictated as much to me, but more so um, because I know what she likes. But there is like maybe one thing that, the mom requested and she didn't even it wasn't even like I had to do it but I wanted to do it so I'm gonna talk about some things really quickly in another video but I just like I said I wanted you guys to see her in video and I just think it's it's just so cool I just love her so much I just wish that I she was staying with me <laughs> Oh my God. I remember when I had the case in, I was like, oh my gosh. I remember Nemo when Nemo got ready to leave. Like there's just so many babies that when they get ready to leave, I just be like, no, 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 don't take my baby away. <laughs> oh my gosh. I got to adjust to this. This is such an adjustment. I don't know how these artists do this like all the time. Like it is such an adjustment for me. So anyway. Bye.